Imagine this for a moment. You've worked hard your entire life, planned for retirement, saved for that dream, only to find yourself in your 70s barely getting by. What if, instead of enjoying those golden years, you're forced to work part-time just to survive? For many baby boomers, this isn't a distant fear. It's happening right now. Once, they were the most powerful generation owning homes, securing steady jobs, living the good life. But today, something terrible is happening. They're losing it all. Now, here's the real shock some boomers, who spent their entire lives building stability, are now at risk of losing their homes some already have. Retirement for them doesn't look like it once did, it's a fight to stay afloat. And it's only getting worse. If you're wondering what's causing this crisis and how it could impact everyone, stay tuned. This story isn't just about boomers, it's about all of us. You don't want to miss what comes next. The baby boomer generation, individuals born from 1946 to 1964, reached a peak of 78.8 million people in 1999. They created one of the largest and most influential generations in history. They are pioneers those who matured during the economic boom following World War II, building families and purchasing homes during the most prosperous years in modern history. From civil rights movements to the technology boom, the boomer generation has shaped much of the world we live in today. They lived in a time when middle-class life was the norm. Jobs were plentiful, education was affordable, and housing was within reach. The promise was clear work hard, and you could retire comfortably. But fast forward to 2024, and the story is very different. Millions of baby boomers now find themselves trapped in a financial and social crisis unlike anything they have ever experienced. The cost of living has soared, wages are stagnant, and an increasingly unaffordable healthcare system is eroding the security they once relied on. In high-cost countries like the United States, Canada, and certain regions in Europe, the baby boomer generation is living longer than any previous generation, but they are not living better. Their homes are more expensive to maintain, their retirement savings are dwindling, and many are forced to return to work to make ends meet. But why? How did a generation that once seemed unstoppable end up here? What happened to the promise of a secure retirement, a comfortable life after decades of hard work? And most importantly, what does this mean for the rest of us? This is not just the story of the baby boomers with the question, are boomers the last generation to achieve the American dream? Or the first to lose it? This is the story of all of us. What happens to the largest aging population has ripple effects on every generation. The cracks in financial security, the struggles with healthcare, and their increasing isolation, these are not just their problems. They are our problems too. And if we do not take action, it may soon be too late. It is hard to believe. A generation that once held the keys to prosperity, ample jobs, affordable housing, and rising incomes now witnesses those opportunities slipping away. What happened between the promise of the American dream and the harsh reality of 2024? The baby boomer generation is currently facing soaring living costs in places like the United States, Canada, and certain regions of Europe. In many major cities, rental prices have skyrocketed. The average rent in New York is about $3,421 a month, while in San Francisco, it is around $3,245 a month. With fixed incomes, boomers often find themselves forced to make tough decisions downsizing, moving away from their communities, or tapping into savings just to cover housing costs. Even basic needs like groceries have become harder to afford. The U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics shows that food prices have steadily increased, with some staple items rising 10 to 15 percent annually since the pandemic began. For those boomers on tight budgets, even trips to the grocery store now cause anxiety as they stretch their fixed income to cover rising food costs. Recent reports indicate that nearly 40 percent of baby boomers have retirement savings of less than $50,000, which is far below what is needed to live comfortably in today's high-cost world. Even those who thought they were prepared are being caught off guard by inflation and unexpected expenses. Rising rents and living costs can now lead to financial ruin. 
With many living on fixed incomes or withdrawing from underfunded retirement accounts, their savings are disappearing. Many boomers now find themselves doing something they never imagined returning to work in their 60s and 70s. The reality is that without stable pensions and with Social Security under strain, they are forced to take part-time jobs just to survive. From retail employees to rideshare drivers, they are doing jobs they thought they left behind years ago. Why? Pensions that once provided lifelong security are disappearing. Instead, self-funded and market-volatile 401k plans have left many boomers facing financial insecurity. According to the Economic Policy Institute, nearly half of baby boomers have no retirement savings, while those who do often find their savings insufficient to cover rising living and housing costs. Adding to their struggles is inflation, particularly in housing. And as housing costs climb, the dream of homeownership is becoming a nightmare for many, forcing some into reverse mortgages or downsizing just to survive. With the uncertain future of Social Security and disappearing pensions, baby boomers are being forced to rewrite the concept of retirement. And with each passing year, the gap between their expenses and income grows wider. So how did this happen? Was it the decades-long recession, the shift from pensions to 401k plans, or simply the rising cost of everything? The answer is complicated but the result is clear baby boomers are no longer getting the retirement benefits they were promised. As financial pressures mount, boomers are also facing an escalating health crisis. What happens when you cannot afford to maintain your health? Stay tuned as we explore the next challenge how the health of an entire generation is rapidly declining. Before we move on to the next segment, I have a special 10-second request for all of you listening. If you can help me in any way, please hit the notification bell and subscribe, that means a lot. It truly helps this channel. And if you do this for me, I promise that my team and I will do everything we can to make this program even better for you. Do we have a deal? The boomer generation expected to age safely, but instead many baby boomers are facing an unexpected and overwhelming reality. After years of hard work, they are not only struggling with financial instability but also confronting a health crisis that endangers their entire generation. But why is this happening? Why has the baby boomer generation become one of the unhealthiest aging populations in history? As we approach the year 2024, the health challenges faced by boomers have reached unprecedented levels. This generation lives longer than any before them, but longevity does not equate to vitality according to estimates from the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services, around 129 million people in the United States have at least one major chronic condition, such as heart disease, cancer, diabetes, obesity, or hypertension, with nearly 60% of them being boomers. And that number continues to rise. However, managing these diseases is only part of the story. Rising healthcare costs are pushing boomers into financial hardship. The Kaiser Family Foundation reports that a retired couple in the United States now needs over $300,000 to cover health care costs throughout retirement, a figure that many cannot afford. You may be thinking of Medicare, the federal health insurance for individuals over 65. This insurance is more affordable than private insurance, but Medicare does not cover long-term care services. Another option is Medicaid, which provides health insurance for low-income Americans. However, to qualify for Medicaid, you must be at 133% or below the federal poverty level, meaning that most baby boomers in the middle class find themselves caught in between too poor to afford the care they need but too wealthy to qualify for Medicaid. Not only that, but rising prescription drug costs are also a significant burden for baby boomers. Many are finding it increasingly difficult to pay for the medications they need to manage chronic conditions. According to reports from ARP, Millions of older Americans are skipping doses, cutting pills in half, or even abandoning prescriptions altogether due to cost concerns. This financial pressure often forces boomers to make tough choices between paying for essential medications or covering other basic needs, such as rent and groceries. One of my audience members shared healthcare has become legal theft. The same angiogram that cost $12,000 six years ago became $38,000 three years ago and the last time it was $70,000. Same hospital, 
same technician, same procedure. A medication that was $20 a month is now nearly $100. I am paying close to $900 a month for health insurance and 20% of the bills that insurance does not cover for hospital payments. Something is wrong. It doesn't stop there because chronic illness is just part of the picture. In another aspect, many baby boomers are also facing another looming health crisis loneliness. Their children, the millennial generation, are also in a tough spot, grappling with housing affordability, stagnant wages, and a looming debt crisis. Many will not be able to take time off work to provide the complex, ongoing support their parents may need. They can't afford to leave their jobs because they can no longer support themselves on a single income. This places them in a difficult position having to choose between caring for aging relatives and their own financial stability. As a result, more and more baby boomers are choosing to live alone, isolated from their communities and families. Studies from the National Institute on Aging show that this loneliness adversely affects health, comparable to risk factors such as smoking and obesity. Without the social support networks they once had, the health of boomers is deteriorating more quickly, and as the healthcare system struggles to meet the needs of an aging population, the future of boomer health remains uncertain. Will this generation receive the necessary care, or will the costs of aging continue to push them deeper into crisis? The health struggles facing boomers are undeniable chronic illness, rising healthcare costs, and growing isolation are taking a heavy toll. But as their physical health declines, they're also facing another challenge one less visible, but just as impactful. How is a generation that once led society now finding itself on the sidelines? In the next chapter, we explore how boomers are losing their social and cultural voice in a rapidly changing world. They were once the architects of change, leading social movements and cultural symbols. The baby boomer generation has shaped the world we live in today. But as society transforms, they are beginning to lose something crucial their voice. How has a generation that once guided society now found itself fading into obscurity in a rapidly changing world? Baby boomers are not just bystanders in history, they have actively created it. From the civil rights movement to the cultural revolution of the 1960s and 70s, they paved the way for the freedoms and advancements that many enjoy today. But now, in the year 2024, as technology and culture continue to evolve at breakneck speed, many baby boomers feel increasingly disconnected from the world they once knew. The rapid growth of social media, new political movements, and the increasing influence of the digital age has created a generational divide. According to the Pew Research Center, many older adults, particularly those over 65, often find it challenging to keep pace with technological advancements. While technology adoption among older adults has increased in recent years, there remains a significant digital divide between older and younger generations. For example, only 61% of individuals aged 65 and older own a smartphone, compared to 96% of those aged 18 to 29. This gap further widens the divide between baby boomers and younger generations, who are more comfortable navigating today's fast-paced technological environment. But the disconnect does not stop at technology. Many baby boomers also feel sidelined in cultural conversations. The platforms that have empowered younger generations, such as Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, have made baby boomers feel out of touch, struggling to maintain relevance in discussions they once led. For a generation that once championed movements for equality, progress, and economic power, being excluded from cultural and social dialogues is a harsh reality. According to research from RP, older adults report feeling left behind in workplace discussions about diversity, inclusion, and modern values areas that younger generations have taken on. It's not just culture baby boomers are also beginning to feel sidelined in politics. While they still wield significant voting power, their priorities, such as health care and social security, often take a backseat to the concerns of younger voters, who focus on issues like climate change, racial justice, and economic inequality. Research from the Brookings Institution indicates that younger generations are now dominating political discussions, as millennials and Generation Z shape policy debates that often overlook the concerns of baby boomers. 
This is a strange reversal baby boomers, who once had the loudest voices in political discussions, now often feel overshadowed by the younger generations eager to take charge. Their concerns about retirement security, health care, and an aging infrastructure seem less urgent in the eyes of younger voters and policymakers, leading many to wonder if their influence is gradually waning. Beyond politics, boomers are facing an emotional struggle the pain of feeling culturally irrelevant. Once trendsetters, they now watch younger generations shape the latest movements, trends, and social norms. As millennials and Generation Z take the lead in the workplace and cultural spheres, baby boomers grapple with the reality of losing their status as influencers in society. So, what happens when an entire generation feels their voice no longer matters? Will baby boomers be pushed to the margins forever? Or is their influence simply changing in ways they have yet to recognize? What does the future hold for boomers? Will they adapt? Or will they be left out? In the next chapter, we will explore what comes next for this generation. The baby boomer generation, once the backbone of economic, social, and cultural movements, now stands at an uncertain crossroads. Financial instability, health crises, and the rapid development of society have many asking what comes next. After contributing so much to the world, they now face challenges that threaten their place within it. What does the future hold for boomers as they navigate a rapidly evolving world without them? Baby boomers have always been resilient, adapting to societal changes over many decades. From surviving economic recessions and embracing technological advancements to pioneering social reforms, this generation has demonstrated impressive perseverance. However, the world in 2024 presents new challenges, digital transformation, evolving workplaces, and skyrocketing living costs. Many baby boomers find themselves once again adapting albeit in unexpected ways. While some return to the workforce to make ends meet, others are entering the gig economy driving for rideshare companies, freelancing, or starting side businesses. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment among individuals aged 65 and older is expected to increase by 37% by the year 2031. This significant rise has redefined retirement what was once a traditional notion of relaxing in their golden years has been replaced by the reality of needing to work into their 70s and 80s to cover rising healthcare costs and living expenses. Additionally, one of the biggest barriers facing baby boomers as they prepare for the future is the digital divide. Many boomers struggle to stay connected in a world dominated by social media, online services, and advanced technology. However, a positive sign is that community programs aimed at teaching digital skills are on the rise, and more baby boomers are embracing technology. Whether it is learning how to use a smartphone to stay in touch with family or engaging in social media, the gap between older adults and younger generations is gradually narrowing. Despite facing new difficulties, this picture is not all bleak. Along with their adaptation process, Boomers are also discovering new ways to contribute to society. Many are redefining aging by mentoring younger generations, sharing their rich experiences, and remaining actively engaged in their communities through volunteer work and social activities. This shows that a generation that once led social change is proving they still have a role in shaping the future, whether through volunteering efforts or supporting younger generations in finding their own paths. What do you think? Can the baby boomer generation reclaim their place and redefine the aging process, or are we witnessing a permanent change? Let us know in the comments what will happen next for this resilient generation. Sometimes, statistics and trends can seem distant, but behind the numbers are real people people like Tom, a baby boomer who lived the American dream, only to see it crumble as he enters the later years of his life. Tom was born in 1950 right at the beginning of the baby boomer generation. He grew up in a world full of opportunities. By his 30s, he had purchased an affordable home, secured a stable job at a manufacturing plant, and began saving for retirement. He was living the dream everything was within reach. But fast forward to the year 2024, and Tom's story has taken a turn. Like many others in the baby boomer generation, he has outlived his savings. His pension, once a guaranteed safety net, has been eroded by economic downturns. His retirement plans? 
Gone. Now in his 70s, Tom works part-time at a local grocery store just to pay the bills. The home he worked so hard to acquire? He has had to downsize, moving to a smaller rental property after losing his original home to foreclosure during the financial crisis of 2008. It is not just financial hardships. Tom's once robust health is now fragile. He struggles with diabetes and high blood pressure, conditions that require expensive medications. Despite having Medicare, rising healthcare costs are eating away at his meager savings. Each trip to the pharmacy serves as a reminder of his precarious situation. Tom's story is not unique. According to ARP, nearly 30% of boomers are facing similar financial struggles, many of them forced to delay retirement or return to work just to make ends meet. And like Tom, they are grappling with balancing increasing healthcare costs against everyday living expenses. Many baby boomers are working part-time, waiting in long lines at pharmacies, and budgeting with limited resources. A remarkable thing is that despite facing numerous challenges, Tom has not given up. He is learning to adapt to this new reality. With the help of local programs aimed at teaching digital literacy, he has begun to acquire new skills, gradually becoming more comfortable with the internet learning how to stay in touch with family, search for part-time job opportunities, and even manage his healthcare through telemedicine. Tom's story is one of both struggle and resilience. While he never expected to be working at his age or facing so many financial and health challenges, he is finding ways to move forward. He is redefining the concept of retirement, even as it strays far from the vision he held years ago. Tom's journey highlights a harsh reality for many in the boomer generation. They have worked hard, done everything they were entrusted with, but now find themselves in situations they never imagined. As we reflect on Tom's story, we wonder what will happen to the millions of boomers who lack the resources or support to adapt like Tom. Do not rush to worry about the rising costs and economic challenges you are facing. There is a perfect solution for you. What if I helped you enjoy your golden retirement years without stressing over financial pressure? Don't miss our video titled The Best Asian Countries to Live on $500 a Month, as it will thoroughly address your concerns. If you found today's video interesting, don't hesitate to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Your support is very important to us. Be sure to check out the next video appearing on your screen. You're sure to love the content we bring. Please leave a comment about which country you'd like us to explore next. Thank you for watching and see you in the latest video. Thanks for being with us on this great journey. Leave your thoughts in the comments and like to help us. Remember to subscribe for more. See you soon.